91-year-old Winnipeg man says a visit to Concordia Hospital has left him homebound. Bert Friesen says blood filled his socks when the stickers from an EKG machine were torn from his legs. An infection followed and his family worries he'll never recover. CTV's Jeff Keel has the story. Age didn't stop Bert Friesen from leading an active life. The 91-year-old still drove. Now he spends most days in this chair because of a trip to Concordia Hospital. It started with a, a mistake or a neglect. Two months ago, Friesen was taken by ambulance to Concordia because he was having trouble breathing. Hospital staff administered an EKG to check his heart. When it was done, Friesen says an employee grabbed the EKG machine in a panic, ripping not only the wires and attached stickers from his legs, but portions of his skin too. Blood was coming out of that wound in particular and uh, soaking up my uh, socks and shoes. Friesen says nurses bandaged his legs, told him they needed to be changed within two days, and he was sent home. When he returned to the hospital two days later, he says no one was willing to change his bandages. His daughter says his legs became infected and her dad can no longer walk. I, I was just aghast at what he was going through. The hospital has apologized to Bert Friesen and his family for what happened, and officials here say they've launched an investigation. We're reviewing everything to see, you know, what happened. Concordia President Valerie Weeb says the hospital is supposed to change bandages on patients' wounds. As for Friesen's initial injuries... We care very deeply for the experience that our patients have, and we want them to know that this was not something that is intentional. Friesen and his daughter accept the hospital's apology. He needs constant care, but has hope he will heal and get around again. His daughter isn't as optimistic, saying her dad has diabetes and congestive heart failure. The last months of his life are being spent like this because of one second careless act. She says the visit to the hospital robbed her dad of his independence. Jeff Keel, CTV News, Winnipeg. Concordia Hospital says it's trying to figure out what kind of community care can be offered to Bert Friesen.